Warren days before its grand opening. It happened today on Child Street. What a disappointment. As you can see, it left a big mess behind. And to add to this injury, the owner telling NBC 10 they were supposed to open to the public this Saturday. Tonight team's Lana Folk in Warren tonight. Janessa Ponte was walking her dog when she stumbled across a tractor trailer truck parked in her Child Street storefront, destroying her business just days before her weekend opening. It's a big letdown. I'm pretty disappointed. It's back to square one for Janessa Ponte. I know it'll be fixed, but it's, it's just a major hurdle and a huge disappointment. After a tractor trailer crashed into her fabric store and drapery studio on Child Street in Warren, Ponte was turning the corner with her dog when she saw the truck. I was there probably one minute after it happened. Her heart sank. Completely devastated and shocked. Just all my hard work. I've been doing everything myself there. <laughs> it's, it's been months of hard work put into this, this place. Warren police say the driver was coming from Main Street when it hit the fabrications building at the corner of Water and Child. No one was hurt. The driver was not charged, but the investigation is ongoing. Business owners telling NBC 10 speed has been an issue in the area. This is a very dangerous corner. You got people who take the corner who just fly down the street. I am amazed that no one's been hit. This is what the store looks like ahead of its Saturday opening. And this is it now. We're still in business. We can still provide all the services to you. A setback, setting up for a major comeback. I'm not letting this defeat me, I'll say that much. <laughs> Janessa hopes to have the business back open as early as May. In Warren, Leanna Falk, NBC 10 News, 19.